Miss Kalina Smith, Miss Wyoming Basketball 2017. But I know basketball isn't quite necessarily the future right now. But uh, uh, talk about, you know, just talk about your basketball career. It's definitely been memorable, really fun. I've had the opportunity to be a, two, a part of two state championship teams. And last year we fell a little short, but still just being a part of the state championship was really good. I've had awesome coaches that have made me the player I am. I've had some really great girls that have pushed me and just made me a really good basketball player. Just, uh, you know, you, 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 it was a little different when you moved from Powell over to Campbell County. I mean, not just different community, but uh, different girls, different teammates, different style of play. What, what all did you have to adjust to? It was a completely different style of basketball. 3A is a lot slower. We had a lot of set plays. Our playbook was huge in Powell. And then Gillette, I think we had, like, one set play, and we never really, like, ran it. We just five out, like, just like athleticism, which is good, because I, I really formed into it well, and I really enjoyed the way Holst, like wanted to play his intensity. He's really defense-oriented, and defense is my favorite part of the game. So it was just a really good move and good change in pace, and I liked it a lot. The opposition or the competition was a bit different as well, wasn't it? Well, freshman year I played post because I was like the tallest person, but I still would always go out to the three-point line. And yeah, it was a different type, different position. I got to be a shooting guard and handle the ball more, which I liked. And the pace was way different. Like a lot of like out running, going, getting the ball, leaking out a lot, and I liked that. We ran a lot during the season, which was hard, but you definitely could show like it showed on the court how good we are and how fast we were. Um. Well, you know, you normally, you know, high school athletes, they use one sport to help get ready uh, for the next. So uh, how was basketball kind of a help to get you ready for the other sports? Um, well, it kind of was. Like, it helped me in, like, volleyball, like, just, like, different, like, muscles that you're using. But I don't know. I've never really been the type of athlete that played other sports to get better for the next sport. I, like, play all the sports because I like them and, like, when I was making a decision on what college I was going to, I really hadn't decided whether I was going to play volleyball or basketball in college until like right before I committed. And so it's really just like every game that I play is for that game specific. It really isn't to get better at the other one. So what was it that volleyball won out over basketball? I don't know. I always loved basketball more. And then when high school hit, I loved volleyball more. But then when I went to Campbell County, Holst made me love basketball again. And I was going back and forth. And my passion for volleyball is just, like, incredible. And the love I have for the game is, like, just something that I feel like I could go to the next level, to the next level, to the next level. Like, just continue. Like, that's the game I want to continue in. So that's kind of how I decided it. Like, I, if I saw myself in five years going to the Olympics, it would be volleyball over basketball. So that's kind of how I picked it. Regardless of event, what gives you the drive to want to continue? I just love the game so much. I don't know. Sports have been, like, my life. Me and my brother grew up battling against each other. And it's just, like, that's, like, what I'm best at, like, over, like, anything. <laughs> so it's just, it's fun. And I like competing and I really like winning so it's just like a game that you can win and just like the competition is awesome. Well Central Michigan definitely is not Wyoming or anything close to that nature. Uh, why all the way out there? I loved the coaches. When I went on my official visit, the girls were just so welcoming and the coaches are so family oriented and they have like different programs that like for team bonding and they keep us together and they're a rebuilding program and I'm really excited because our recruiting class coming in is so good. We have like a few other girls that were all American and so I just feel like we're going to click so well and it was just a really good opportunity and I know it's really far from home and that's going to be kind of hard but I just honestly like my focus right now is just to be the best volleyball player that I can be and so if that means sacrificing and having to go 20 hours from home I'm definitely down for it. <laughs> Uh, now, I ask this to everybody, you know, who goes to school out of state. Uh, while you were talking with everyone over there, uh, over at Central Michigan, were they kind of just giving you a little bit of a hard time? You're like, oh, you're from Wyoming? Uh, where, where, where's that? Uh, uh, what's that like? Well, there's like a Wyoming, Michigan. So when I went there for my visit and I'd like tell the girls, oh, I'm from Wyoming. They're like, oh, that's only like 30 minutes away or something. And I was like, no, that's like 20 hours away. Like it was a full day of like traveling. And they're like, 
oh my gosh and then you get the typical like Wyoming questions like do you guys have horses and I'm like no <laughs> it's funny the way they like they think that Wyoming is just like so country oriented it's funny <laughs> <laughs>